You might have been told it might take you a minimum of 90 minutes to get at least one starter Pokemon to be able to spawn in the wild. But I'm going to show you how you can get all of them in less than that. So you need three things to set this up. One, you need a copy of Scarlet Violet with the Indigo Disc DLC. Two, you need Pokemon Home. And three, you need a game with your starter in it. This is so you can transfer it via Pokemon Home to Pokemon Scarlet and Violet. And the reason this is, is this is just a hypothesis that the game registers a register in the Pokedex, so what it does is just start spawning in the wild. It's not 100% confirmed, but that's just my hypothesis. But here is the whole process in action. Alright, so now they're in Pokemon Home. What you want to do is go to Settings, then you want to go to... No, not Uploads. You want to go to Connected Devices and Services, then to Pokemon Home. This is so you can transfer the specific Pokemon you want to Pokemon Home. The Pokemon we'll be using for this example is Froakie. Now, I have this Froakie here, really good IVs. But you can do this with any starter that you want. It's just that I'm using Froakie for this specific example. Once you select the Pokemon you want, you're going to transfer it up through Pokemon Go to Pokemon Home. Once you're in Pokemon Home, what you're going to do is receive the Pokemon using the Pokemon Go option in the menu. This is so you can actually get the Pokemon into Pokemon Home. Once you're done with that, close Pokemon Home and open your copy of Scarlet and Violet with the Indigo Disc DLC downloaded. Alright, once you're in Scarlet and Violet, what you're going to do is you're going to look up where specific way to find your specific starter. In this case, we're doing Froakie. And to find Froakie, you're going to go into this spot on the map, which is right around this mountainous area, which is where Froakie spawns. Uh, future editing Prima for here, uh, I forgot to tell you that it does spawn in the coastal biome specifically. And just like that, you'll get Froakie spawning in the wild without having to spend any BP. This works on every starter Pokemon, and you can also shiny hunt these, which is insanely cool. And that's how I was able to get my shiny Poplio from my previous video. But yeah, that's all you need for this to work. You can do this with any, like I said, you can do this with any starter Pokemon. You can do this practically at any time, but I'd recommend doing it once you unlock the ability to transfer BP as to play it safe and not ruin your game. Thank you so much for watching. If you found this tutorial useful, make sure you hit that like button, subscribe. I hope to do more of these tutorial videos if you want me to do them. But yeah, that's all for me. Peace.